South Carolina heading to Clemson. Clemson, a 14-point favorite. Total sits at 52. This is Saturday, 12 p.m. Eastern Time on ABC. And let's go on and pull up the stats for you. Now, these stats are, of course, over the past five weeks. I, I've got Clemson winning this game 29 to eh, 17, somewhere around there. So I've got Clemson by like 12 and a half, basically. I look at this, and you see Clemson is number 74 in PPA margin over the past five weeks. Cle- uh, South Carolina is number 50, number 108 in offensive PPA per drive for Clemson, number 121 in defensive PPA per drive for uh, South Carolina. But South Carolina's offense over the last five weeks, number 25 in PPA per drive, and the Clemson defense is number 19. It's pretty crazy to look at this. Uh, This Clemson offense, I believe, is going to be able to run all over the South Carolina defense. Clemson number 46 in PPA per rush on offense, South Carolina number 125 in that. Clemson number 13 in rushing success rate, South Carolina number 128. So there is a distinct advantage. Uh, there's a huge advantage as far as standard down success rate. So Clemson will be able to stay ahead of the chains. They'll be able to keep the ball away from South Carolina's offense. Uh, Clemson number 22 in standard down success rate. South Carolina number 120 in that spot. And this South Carolina defense has not been good over the past five weeks at all. Now, you look on offense, and where has South Carolina had the most success whenever they actually have had success? Uh, that would be throwing the football. Number 12 in PPA per pass. They're number 44 in passing success rate. Number 15 in passing explosiveness. They are pretty good on passing downs as well whenever they do get behind the chains because, well, they they sometimes do, right? Um, 35% of their plays are passing down. So third and long, etc. Or second and long, third and long, whatever it is. The Clemson defense is really good against the pass. Turns out, over the past five weeks, they're number 10 in PPA per pass. They're number 21 in passing success rate allowed. And they're number 21 at causing havoc. So they're going to be after Spencer Rattler. And that's one thing that Tennessee was not able to do. They were not ev- they were never able to get him uncomfortable. Clemson is going to be on top of that. Absolutely. Uh, as far as running the football, like if, if Lloyd is back for South Carolina, maybe these numbers change a little bit. Uh, but I still kind of trust... Clemson's defensive line to be able to stop the run here, um, even if they have not done a great job as of late. They're number 78 in PPA per rush defense, while South Carolina's number 59 in PPA per rush on offense. Uh, But success rate, you know, flipped around. South Carolina number 83 on offense, uh, Clemson number 64 on defense. I I look at this, I don't believe that South Carolina is going to have as much success against this Clemson defense, and I think that Clemson's offense is perfectly set up to be able to score on South Carolina's defense. I'm going to take Clemson minus the 14. There's, I think there's going to be a lot of people on South Carolina. Oh, it's finally Spencer Rattler got it figured out, etc. Eh, let's just let's hold off on this uh, because we all kind of thought the same thing last year. You know, after uh, South Carolina's went over Auburn, after they went over Florida, and they go into that Clemson game against the Clemson team that was not very good, uh, that didn't have a whole lot to play for other than just pride, and Clemson beat them 30 to nothing. In Columbus. Now, South Carolina's got to go to Clemson with Clemson still having a shot at the playoffs. Throwing it out there. Just throwing it out there. Give me Clemson. Minus 14 on this one. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app. And make sure to leave a nice five-star review. You can follow Gary on Twitter, at GaryWCE. And the show is at Winning Cures. Be sure to check out the merch in our web store and share the show.